What is this all about? Why is everything tipping over? Come on! I told you to cut ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm sorry! How's it going everyone? My name is Swingpoint, and this is a game called The Witch's House. I'm super excited to play it. Let's get straight into it, and I can talk to you guys while we are playing. Hi, little girl. <gasps> is that a kitty? I see a kitty. This is a game called The Witch's House. It's an RPG maker horror game, so there's going to be some scares. It was designed by somebody named Fumi, and it's about a mysterious house in the woods that this little girl discovers, and she finds out that it is haunted, and there's a lot of scary stuff in there, and she has to find a way out. But anyway, let's start moving forward and talk to this kitty here. You're up in that, man. That's how this cat's going to talk. It's going to happen. Human shouldn't be out here. It's too dangerous. Oh, so the kitty is how you save in this game. But now we have to find out where we're going. The house out of the forest. Let's go out of the forest. <laughs> I mean, game over real quick, right? Da -da -da -da! Can I not go through the flowers? Aww. Okay. Can I go back in here? Look at this. What's this thing? I found something rusty and sharp. Take it. Why not? Got a machete. <laughs> Let's do it. The, the type of game that this is going to be is... It's very story focused. It's going to make you feel uncomfortable. There's going to be some situations that are a little rough to absorb. There's going to be elements that make you feel emotionally attached to the game. I, I know you're going to love it. These games have gotten such good reviews and people have loved them so much. And I'm so excited to play through this. I haven't played through the game or really seen any gameplay of it, but I know it's amazing. Okay, so now we should be able to use our machete. And cut roses, right? Nailed it! The way is cleared. The machete broke! Damn it! <laughs> that could be useful for any Ooga Boogas we may encounter. <gasps> Hi, kitty! Hi! Huh? What is it? Dot, 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 dot. <laughs> hmm. So the way out is blocked by the roses. <laughs> Mysteriously opening door. <laughs> you gonna go in? Definitely. Might as well if you can't leave. Should that be my cat voice? I don't know. I feel like that's... Uh, this guy reminds me of that cat from Alice in Wonderland. Like, he's gonna be... Somebody's gonna kind of guide me along, but he's gonna be a dick at the same time. I'm not sure. I just... Black cat, you never know what you're gonna get. That's crazy! Well, let's just go around and move around in here. Oh, there's blood. Why is there blood? Did you see what was right above that thing right Surprise. there? Surprise! What? <laughs> What? I gotta go to the- oh. Okay, I'm not falling for that twice. Let's go inside here. So this must be the witch's house. But we're not going to step on the blood. Let's try to move in there and not step on the blood this time. Nailed it! Come to my room. Okay. Oh, the sign's gone. Where's your room? Oh, there's stuff here. Hi, kitty! Yo. <laughs> Decided I'd follow you for a few laughs. Incidentally, where the heck did you come out from? So it looks like every time I find a kitty, I can save. So that's good. Kitties are good. Ooh, can I take the scissors? There's a pair of scissors on the workbench. Take. Yeah. The chain to the bench? What? Why would you do that to your scissors? A dusty old dresser. There's nothing inside. It's locked. Okay, this room sucks. The author, or the creator, asked that people be very respectful of the topics that are addressed in this game. Because it can be a very emotional game, a very heavy game on your emotions. And he just asked that people are respectful in the comments and things like that, so. Well, what's going on in here? Presents? I want presents. Happy birthday to me. A teddy bear rests against a pile of presents. Take the teddy bear. I got a teddy bear. That feels like a bad idea. I've never seen a horror game where a teddy bear is a good... Good idea. What was that all about? Hello? A present fell from the pile. Should I take it? No. <laughs> okay. It says, opens when the house returns to... No normal. What's wrong with it now? The house seems pretty normal so far. I mean, a six, uh, never mind. That room was kind of weird. Read the witch's diary. Hell yes. I was sick, so no one played with me. My father and my mother didn't love me. A large clock. Time marches on. That sounds like it's going to be significant. I don't know why, but just the way that was phrased, that sounded like a big deal. Teddy! Hi! The basket has a big teddy bear in it. And there's a little bit of room on the left. Should I put the other teddy bear in there? Teddy. Put in basket. Its limbs make it too big to fit. <gasps> Maybe... I don't want to chop up the teddy bear. Bears in the basket. 
<laughs> okay, let's put a band a basket. It was a tie between this and Mad Father, but I'm not entirely sure I'm allowed to play Mad Father without permission from the author. So I decided to play this game because this game said in the readme that you can play this, no big deal. But now let's cut off some teddy bear limbs like a morbid little psycho. <laughs> Got a teddy bear torso. Wh what? You see that blood? It's a teddy bear! There's bloody scissors on the workbench. It's a teddy bear! Oh! What was that? Why aren't you letting me observe this? Why want to know what that was all about? Oh, uh, okay. Let's save here. Let's talk to Mr. Catman. <laughs> what was that? Hello? Hello? A vase of roses. Well, what was that noise? Okay. Well, let's go over here. Hi, Teddy. I got something for you. Teddy bear torso. Perfect. This is just... Why would you chop up somebody's teddy bear and put it in a basket, huh? You heard an unlocking sound from somewhere. Oh, that's why. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Okay, I pissed off the sign. Oh! oh! Okay, that doesn't seem very scary. If you're watching this right now, it doesn't seem like a big deal. But if you have headphones... Yes. A large clock. Time marches on. Like I was saying, it doesn't seem like a big deal if you're just, you know, watching on YouTube, no headphones on. But if you're wearing headphones and you're just walking by and something goes, bah! Right, like, right in front of you. Oh, God. <laughs> it gets you. What is this all about? Why is everything tipping over? Come on. I told you. To ah! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. Holy shit. <laughs> What? What was a giant teddy bear? <laughs> now I can sprint around like this, so I'm probably gonna have to do that with Mr. Teddy Monster. Wait, I have a letter? What does the letter say? Do you see that? I don't care. Letter. Item. What does it say? Read? Mind if you go to her house, but just stay away from the forest. Hope to see you home soon. Dad. Hmm. Okay. The plot thickens. <laughs> okay, I'm ready for this. Okay. Okay. Now that's gonna tip over, right? Okay, now get ready for Teddy Zilla. You ready? Ah! No, 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 no! Oh, god damn it! He squished me with his ass! No, 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 no! Oh, god! He kicks! God damn it! Okay, now this time I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna run back into the door. How's that sound? Oh, shit. Why is that. Skype! Okay, now I'm gonna head back into the room I was just in, right? Oh, no, 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 no! Perfect, right? Now, what if I come back out? Now, are you still there? Oh, perfect! Nailed it! Well, let's talk to Mr. Kitty here before I get my ass kicked. Good, 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 good. Oh, teddy bear prints. Now, this unlocked probably. Did I drop those? Teddy bear's limbs on the ground. Why are they blo- Don't take them? I can take them? Why would I do that? Should I put the teddy bear back together? Can I- I could probably go in here though, right? Door opened. Perfect! What's going on in here? Oh, I can push chairs around. Cool. Taste poison? What? What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> the wine bottles are lined up on the shelf. Well, that's cool. Anything else? A fireplace. Look inside. What's inside? Dot, 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 dot. Nothing but soot. Okay. Well, that's going to be something that's probably important later. If I can look inside and look around, it's probably going to be there later. The cook is busy. Lend a hand. Uh, okay. Oh! Oh, oh, crockroach. Did I just step on it? I think I did. <laughs> there's no chef. Game, there's no chef. So it's like the chef from South Park. He's dead. There's a shadow, though. Hello? There's someone invisible there. That's creepy. Talk? Ah, I'm busy. So busy. Lend a hand? Oh, no, wait. Oh, give it the teddy bears, right? Grabs your arm, puts your wrist onto the cutting board. <laughs> A hand is exactly what I needed. Oh, it's turning red. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> I love how the game just ends. Game over! Maybe I can give him the teddy bear limbs. Because those are hands, right? <laughs> hand over teddy bear limbs, right? Oh, thank you. I was in need of a hand or two. Let me show my appreciation. Oh, I got a silver key. Good. Okay. Good, 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 good. 
Oh, I squished him! Come here! <laughs> it's locked. Oh, wait, I have a silver key. Can I go in there with that? It's tough squishing him. Use key. Doesn't fit at all. Oh! Cockroaches! I'm sorry! <laughs> well, what about this room? Whoa! What? I didn't... How did that work? Jeez, you freaked me out. It didn't come out of nowhere like that. Right? I don't know how I got here. Why is there a footprint on the wall? This looks different in here. Whoa, what was that? Oh! God! Oh, they're not scary at all, but they totally get me. Did you see that thing that was up here? There was totally something up here. Totally something up here. Come on, don't F with me. There was something here. Uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. You saw that, right? I'm not just making this up. There was something that scurried up top there. These games are supposed to be really good. And you kind of get freaked out. I, like, I'm free. Oh, can I touch this now? A strangely colored soup in a skull-shaped bowl. Don't drink it! Should I drink it? Okay, fine. Let's drink it so we can see what happens. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> yes. Dot, 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 dot. Dot, 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 dot! Voila, I was poisoned! Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Whoa, what's going on here? Was I supposed to do that? No, damn it! <laughs> well, something unlocked when I did that. What? Because for some reason that unlocked a door. There's gotta be a reason. <laughs> what do I do about that, though? These are puzzle-based games, if you didn't already get the, get the gist of that. But you know how I do videos. How this happens is... I go through the stuff, and if there's anything that I feel that you guys don't need to see right away, that doesn't really help aid the story at all, I get rid of it. That way you guys can watch as much as you can in as little time as possible and enjoy the game as much as possible. A book titled Dining of the Aristocrats. Read. People of ruling and wealthy classes have long enjoyed dining with silverware. By using such hard-to-clean cutlery, they could hire servants to demonstrate their wealth. In addition, silver utensils change color upon contact with poison, making them quite use useful. How's it make them useful? Well, that that's probably what the skull is right there, so I need to get some sort of silver utensil. Lined with tableware, glasses, seasonings, nothing particularly eye-catching. But yeah, I need to get some... Maybe I can use the silver key in the poison here, right? Right? I got silver, don't I? Did I save before? Good. Because it's, I mean, I don't have a silver, silverware, tableware, but I have a silver key. So, put the key in the soup. Yeah! It even lets me do it. Good. Dot, 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 dot! The key turned black in the soup! Yes! So, we heard an unlocking so Did, What was over here? I just saw something in here. I saw something. I'm not going to look in there, but I totally saw something in there. So, is that how I unlocked the door? Put the key in there? Woo! God, I'm sorry. Why does stuff just fall over in this place, man? I could probably go in here now, right? The door has opened. Yeah! You know, for a puzzle game, I don't feel like I'm... What was that? You saw that. That's not even... That wasn't even kind of subtle. What are you doing here? That's probably the witch. Witch, where'd you go? Hi, kitty! Oh my god, I'd love to see you. A decorative cat's ornament. Where? Gotcha. <laughs> He got me. An armor figure with a spear. Feels like he could move at any moment. No, 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 no. What's in here? This looks suspicious as foobar. We're gonna have to end this episode here, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I'm super excited to keep showing you this game. It gets even better. The story starts to progress a little bit more and you start to learn a little bit more about what is going on with this house, why it's haunted, and the history behind the witch that owns the place. I hope you'll continue to join me on this journey for this game. It's gonna be a multi-part walkthrough. I know you guys love these walkthroughs. I love these walkthroughs because it gives me a chance to bond with you guys a little bit more. But other than that, I hope you're having a wonderful day and I will see you in the next episode. Yeah. Goodbye! What? <laughs> oh, I even knew it was coming. How's it going, everyone? My name is Swing Point, and this is a game called The House 2. It's one of those old-fashioned flash horror games that really just gets in your face.